Hello, hello, Hazy Nation. It's your boy Hazy Panda Gaming here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the drop zone parachute. So first things first, you're going to need some chains, um, a bulletproof helmet, and glasses. That's it. So after that, you're going to go to online jobs, Rockstar created. You're going to go down to adversary mode, and you're going to load up drop zone. So once you load up a drop zone, you're going to get your friends in there, obviously. You're going to need three other people with you so you can actually start the game. So I'm going to get everyone in here real quick. Skip forward to when everyone's in here. My party members. <laughs> Alright, so now that everyone's in here, we are going to start it up. And then this is the important part. Whichever color team you're on, that's what color your parachute's going to be. So I want purple because I have the purple joggers and bulletproof helmet. So I'm going to load this up. You can Everyone can just hit ready if everyone has the right color that they want. So once everyone's ready, you are going to spawn in the helicopter. And uh, you are pretty much just going to jump to the ground and parachute down. Look at that cargo bob. All right, so now that we're here, we're gonna jump down and you don't have to land on like the capture point, especially if you're doing this with randoms, you're gonna wanna land away from the drop point. So once you're close to the ground, you're just gonna pull your parachute and you're gonna pull up your phone. So I'm gonna do that here now. So once you pull up your phone, you're going to go down a job list and you're going to hit square and hover over that. And right before you hit the ground, just hit X, just like that. See, I was just about to touch the ground. So after you do that, it's going to load you back into a invite only lobby or whatever you're in. You're going to go grab a helicopter real quick. So I'm going to skip forward so you guys don't have to watch me driving around everywhere. All right. So now that I got a helicopter. As you can tell, I have the same outfit on. I'm in the same lobby by myself. So once you're in the helicopter, you're just going to fly over like over the ocean anywhere. It doesn't matter which location you are on the map. You just got to fly over the sea so you can parachute down. You basically do this so you can see if you have the parachute or not. And you have to do this next part of the glitch in the water anyways. So I'm going to head on over near Merriweather over here. I don't even know why I shouldn't have flown over here, but oh well. Alright, so once you're over the ocean, you're just going to jump out and pull your chute. And as you can tell, I still have the purple parachute. You'll be able to tell in a second here. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it is purple. I'm sure you'll be able to see it when we hit the water here. You just want to land anywhere in the water. It doesn't matter, by the way, you guys. You got to get up. Uh, so after that, you're going to go down to helmet visor. Actually, we took my helmet off there, but oh well, don't do that. All right, so as you can see, it says helmet visor right there. You're just going to hit right on the directional pad for about 15, 20 seconds. So I'm going to do that here now. It's a pretty easy glitch, you guys. Sometimes it doesn't work first try. Just try like one or two more times, you'll get it. So after you do that, you're going to go to accessories and you are going to go to chains and you're just going to do the same thing. Keep hitting right on the directional pad. Now, as you can tell, I'm lagging pretty bad right now. So something's not, something's working right now. It's not good. The game's not supposed to do that. So after you do that for about 20 seconds, you're going to go up to glasses and do the same thing. And you do that for about another 20 seconds. You can do this for 30 if you guys want to play it safe. I'm just doing it for 20 just for sakes of the time on the video. I know it's going to be a long one, but oh well. All right, so after I'm done that, I'm going to put my glasses to none. I'm going to make sure, like, you'd still have your helmet on if you're doing this with the kill code outfit. I just accidentally did that. But after that, you're going to go to jobs, rockstar created, and you're going to load up any mission. I'd suggest doing a regular mission just so you can go in by yourself. 
Like I'm gonna do this all in the game. Doesn't matter what difficulty it's on, you can literally just start the mission up. So once you start it, you're literally just gonna ready up. It doesn't matter. So now that we're in the mission, you are literally just going to pull up your phone again and quit. That's it. You literally just got to quit. And then when you spawn back in, you should have the parachute. So I'm going to show you that here now. Literally just pull up my phone and quit. And I don't have the parachute right now, as you can tell. And I'm going to leave this loading screen in here so you guys can see that I actually did this. And a little thing about this glitch, you guys, is um, to actually put it back on, you're going to, whenever you switch outfits, you're going to want to go back to the ammunition and make sure you put the parachute back on. If you don't, when you switch, it's going to have your regular parachute on. So you have to go back to the ammunition to fix this. Yeah, so once... As you can tell, I have the purple parachute, and I will let you guys know right now how to put it back on if it takes it off and puts your other one on. I'm going to head on to the ammunition, go to store, ammunition, wardrobe, and select shoot outfit. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and you hit that subscribe button, and you go save this outfit because I love putting up these glitches for you guys. Till next time, Hasty Nation, have a wonderful day.